are so beautiful. Wait, 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 wait. You are so beautiful to me. Can't you see? You're everything I hoped for. Another one. Uh, everything I need. You are so beautiful to me. My name is Willie Ramos and I'm the ghetto preacher. Obviously, I have to be a preacher because I can't sing to save my life. Well, some theologians say I can't preach either. <laughs> but one of my favorite Bible verses of all time is Psalm 139, 14. That says, and we all know it, or we should. A lot of ladies know this for some reason, more than guys. But Psalm 139, 14 says, You are fearfully and wonderfully made. Did you get that? Listen, you are wonderful. I looked up the word in the dictionary, to be honest, and it means excellent. It means marvelous. It means great. Fearfully, what? And wonderfully made. Undisputed. I know a lot of people that don't want to move on with life until they get their hair did or their nails did or they lose weight or they gain weight or they go to the gym. They put their life on hold. Everything is on pause because they want to look better or feel better when the reality is you are already made wonderful. Man, but we are so insecure. Maybe it's because of social media, right? Like on Instagram, everybody filters their pictures. On Facebook, everybody filters their profile pictures. On Snapchat, what? You got like roses and flowers and birds coming out your head. Man, everything is just, you have to look great. You have to look great. Nobody puts a jacked up picture in their profile, right? Nobody puts themselves in pajamas or, or looking all jacked up and busted on their profile picture. Maybe it's the pressure that we gotta look good. Maybe it's Hollywood. Maybe the media tells you that you have a look a certain way. The media is gonna tell you, man, that you gotta add this or subtract that, right? You gotta add this beauty product. You gotta uh, go to the gym and go to Platinum Fitness for $10 a month, or you gotta lose this weight, or you gotta drink this Slim Fast, or go on the Kato diet, or whatever diet. I don't even know if I'm saying it right, because obviously I don't diet. Someone say mercy, but it's always that you have to add or subtract, when in reality, the Bible says that you were already made beautiful. Did you hear that word? Made? You was already made. You don't have to add or subtract nothing. So today I invite you to look in the mirror. Look in the mirror and say, man, I look good, right? In fact, ask me how I'm doing. Ask me how I'm doing. How you doing, Willie? I'm fine, <laughs> you know what I mean? That's a double meaning, I'm fine. Remember, look in the mirror and call yourself beautiful because that's how God sees you. In fact, I think if God has a microphone in heaven, he would sing to you and say this. You are so beautiful to me.